Hey everybody, the Bond is back. Welcome to part 28 of Let's Play Final Fantasy VII, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. You know what, I think it is a good time to check out the Gold Saucer now, should we? I think we gotta go this way. Oh, that's where everybody went. Barrett, what happened? Sorry. What happened? He just said he was sorry. My hometown used to be around here. What do you mean, used to? It ain't here no more. Heard it got buried in just four years. But how could those people say those terrible things? With words, I would say. And it's my fault. All of my fault. Okay, so we're just getting some flashbacks. My hometown. Corral's always been a coal mining town. It may be dusty and poor, but it's calm. It's a real small town. Oh god, I read this fast. That's the first time I've heard Mako Reactor mentioned since then. I don't know if those were dogs or cats chasing that guy over there. What are we going to do? The only one opposed to this is dying. I am definitely against it, no matter what. There's nothing to talk about if you're thinking of throwing away our coal. The coal's been ours for generations. Our fathers, and theirs before them, risked their lives for it. We have no right to throw it all away so easily. But listen, Dine. No one uses coal nowadays. It's a sign of the times. Right. Everything is Mako now. It'll be alright, Dine. Shinra Incorporated will guarantee your livelihood once the Mako reactor is completed. Listen, Dine. I don't want my wife, Myrna, to suffer anymore. I know how you feel. I feel the same way too, damn it. But even so, I won't give away our coal mines. Dine, you've got to understand. I laugh his last name is Omite oh or something. You know, get it? Dine Omite? Oh Maybe it actually is. That's how the Corel reactor was built and completed. By right, that guy looking at his knees. We all thought it would bring us an easier life. Ah, uh, until that happened. It happened when Dine and I were out of town for a few days. Corel was burned down by the Shinra troops. All the townspeople, all my relatives, everyone, everything. Shinra troops? What for? There was an explosion at a reactor. Shinra blamed the accidents on the people. Said it was done by a rebel faction. That's so terrible! Well, I guess that's true. But more than Shinra, I can't forgive myself. Never should have gone along with the building of the reactor. Don't blame yourself! We were all fooled by the promises Shinra made back then. That's why. That's why I get so pissed off. Not only did they take advantage of me, but I lost my wife, Myrna, too. Hey everyone, if you want to go to the Gold Saucer, hurry and get on. You know what, let's go on the ropeway. Let's get on. Don was my best friend close ever since we were kids. Well, Cloud didn't seem to carry, just went on. I never knew. Baron never said a thing. I'm not sympathizing with Barrett. He never should have trusted Shinra Incorporated. Oh, Yuffie is so harsh. We better go on. Surprise, there's enough seats for all of us. This would definitely seem like a fun ride in real life. But I would imagine it would be so risky, because, you know, like the propeller blades and all those wires. Looks like they're so close to each other. Oh, this could not look any godier. Oh 
my goodness. It's is it really made out of gold? So bright. I imagine the the electric bills are gonna be higher than Snoop Dogg. Good lord. Is this where we gotta be next? Welcome, Gold Saucer. My name is not Gold Saucer. It's the name of the place. Oh, this does not look any more disheartening at all. What is this place? Welcome to the Gold Saucer. Welcome to you too, you oversized chicken nugget. Welcome to the Gold Saucer. Are you together? A single pass is 3,000 gil. Or you can purchase a lifetime pass for 30,000 gil. I'm not gonna pay yet. First, I'm gonna save. Cause I just noticed the uh, save station right over there. What? Each transaction will fast cost five gold pieces here? I'll pay. Wait a minute. How do you... Oh! It's gold points. Okay, so it has nothing to do with gold. My, my money is my gill. Please, buy your ticket here. No, you go to me. I can't believe you gotta use, like, gold points just to, uh, save your game here. If you leave Gold Saucer, your po tickets become invalid. Oh, they're perishable. Here at the Gold Saucer, there are many places where you must pay with GP. Just think of GP as money that you can only use at the Gold Saucer. GP can only be redeemed at the games in Wonder Square and at the Chocobo races. Your GP limit is 10,000, so please be careful. Okay. Please enjoy yourselves. I'll definitely try. Oh man, if you're into br not into bright colors, you might want to turn away. Why does everything have to be so gaudy? Wow! Let's have fun! I know this isn't the right time to do this. Yeah, given we just heard Barrett's backstory. Hey Barrett, cheer up! I ain't in a cheery mood, so just leave me alone. Really? That's too bad. Let's go! Was that a little harsh, Eris? Just act normal when this happens. You think so? Of course. We're gonna go play. So play! Mess around all you want! Don't forget we're after Sephiroth. And he just went to the Wonder Square. I think he's mad. You think? He'll be fine. He seems to be doing a little better now. Yeah, that's your definition of better. We better be careful. Sephiroth might be around. Uh, let's all go together. Uh, I'll take you as well. Oh, you can only take one person? That's weird. Okay, so what's this at the top? You're in the gold gate. Okay. Event Square is where an entertaining show awaits you. Chocobo Racing takes you to the world of virtual reality. Bark, bark. Please come stay at the hotel. Ha, ha, ha. Battle Square is where you go to the limits in heated battles. Try your hand at the special gold attack. Round Square is where you take a tour of the park and see the beautiful night scenery of Gold Saucer. Aww. Speed Square is where a shooting roller coaster is waiting to take you into the world of excitement. Wonder Square is where a number of games await you here. Collect GP of Wonder Square and play some more. And it just says Welcome to Gold Saucer. And these are the many attractions. Live from one zone to another. Aww, Dio is here before he died. Let's check out the event square first. Sorry, but there's no show now. Oh. 
Well, this is largely disappointing. Why are all these people still here? There's not even a show going on. Why are you here? We put on a really unusual show here, but not today, so come back again sometime and see it. Why are these people even here? Like, there's nothing going on. You're just wasting time. Oh, you want to be alone. Oh, okay. Well, you're not really alone. There's still people in the room with you. I'm sure they have good peripheral vision. I'm gonna talk to those nosy asses. What is the speed square? Can you, like, put on some pants? Hey, boy! 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 How is it? You having fun? Hmm... So you are having fun. Well, good. Good for you, boy. My name's Cloud. Stop calling me boy. Who, me? I'm the owner of the Gold Saucer. The name's Dio. Just call me Dio. He's not even listening. By the way, boy, do you know what a black materia is? Black materia? Haha, <laughs> I say, that's a good one, boy. But it's not good to lie. You can't fool me. Why'd you ask me? Well, a while back, a boy your age came in and asked me if I had black materia. I thought you might know who he was, seeing as how we were both about the same age. Did he happen to have a black cape? Why, yes! Yes, indeed! And a tattoo on his hand that said one. Where did he go? Haha, <laughs> I have no idea. Well then. I say, stop by the battle arena if you like, boy. You'll probably like it. Many of my collections are on display there. Ha ha ha! You have to be careful of these steps. What? A lot of things. I don't know what you're talking about. Okay, there's Battle, Wonder, Chocobo... Okay, a lot of these things are all, all in this place. Are they, like, literally all connected here? Okay, that was weird. Why is the place set up like this? It's just so strange. I shan't, because I have nothing. Okay. Ghost Square, I believe, is the hotel. Let's try the Wonder Square. Hey, you! What are you looking so down for? Oh, wow, you look big. How about it? Want me to read your fortune? A bright future. A happy future. Oh, but don't hold it against me if it doesn't come true. Oh, so sorry. I'm a fortune-telling machine. The name's... Oh, this is actually like a cat that's talking with a crown and a fat-ass moogle. So his name's Kate Sith. You can only read the future? You kidding? I can find missing things. Missing people. Anything. Then can you tell me where a man named Sephiroth is? Sephiroth, right? Okay, here goes. You do that by headbutting your Moogle friend? Ordinary luck. It will be an act of fortune. Given to the goodwill of others, and something big will happen after summer. Wait, hold on. Huh? Uh, let me try again. I can imagine this is very awkward to look at. Be careful of forgetfulness. Your lucky color is... blue? Forget it. Wait! Wait, give me another chance! Wait, let me try it again! Just admit you don't know where he is. What the? What? What you pursue will be yours, but you will lose something dear. I don't know if it's good or bad. This is the first time ever I got something like this! Then shall we? 
What are you talking about? Being a fortune teller, this is gonna bug me. If I don't see how it turns out, I'll never be able to relax. So, I'm going with you. What are we gonna do, Cloud? I'm coming with you no matter what you say. Hey, hey! I guess he's coming with us. Level 22, but he has over a thousand HP already. Let's see what he's got on him. The Manipulate Materia. Okay, that's actually pretty good. And he's got Transform as well. I'm actually gonna change his equipment a little bit. So let's see, what can I replace it with? I'll replace it with a Shinra Beta. The reason why I'm doing that is because I want Cloud to have the Silver Armlet. That's actually pretty good on him, too. Yeah, we'll just stick it as is. Also, we're gonna change around uh, Kate Sid's materia as well. Do I have everything arranged normally? And yeah, now I do. Alright. I'll give you the throw command, I suppose. And cover. Give you a long range. Fire. Earth. And choke boulder. Okay, you lost some of that HP, but that's okay. You attack with a yellow microphone? Uh, I'll give you a peace ring. They probably told you at the entrance, but most of the attractions that Gold Saucer only take GP. They don't sell GP. You can only get them from the Wonder Square ch games or at the Chocobo races. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. You guys don't want to talk? Okay, whatever. Let's see where Barrett went. Did he go this way? You have zero GP. Yeah, I know. Why would you ask to be to exchange for prices if you know I have zero? Hold down OK to gain strength. Release OK to shoot. Okay. Yeah, I'll try it. Oops. What kind of ball dribbles like that? Let me go let me, one more game. Yes! Oh, I got to keep going. That, did that actually count? Nice. Okay, that was odd. But I got 2 GP for it. So let's try another game. What prizes can I get here, anyway? Oh, I can get like 2 potions. Uh, there's an ether, an X potion, a turbo ether, a gold ticket, and a bunch of question marks. Okay. I don't want to exchange. Arm wrestling, mega sumo, one game, 100 gil. What do you do? I'll try sumo wrestler. Push OK consecutively. Ready? Go! I don't know how fast I have to push it, but it looks like I won. I only got one GP, so I guess if I tried the wrestler, I would have to, like, uh, press faster. Those are like the only games I could play, really? Wait, I could probably play the crane game. Well, that's your problem. Wonder Catcher! Let's try it. Oh, wow! That was actually pretty good. Let me try that again. Oh. Well, you win some, you lose some. Yeah, I still got over 6,000. I'm not gonna play anything else for now. Oh, there's more games. Nope, I'm not quitting until I clear this. What about the bike game? Can I play the bike game? Oh, fine, I'll play fortune telling. I don't know how this gets me GP. Use caution in relationships. Screw you. Back there. Oh, I guess you guys are trying this too. Mog House. Don't worry about me. Go ahead and play. Yeah, I want to play. Oh, there we go. What is Mog House? This is Mog's house. It's a Mog Forest on Mount Mog. The beginning of another day in the life of a Mog. This year. 
Mog is Pipa Popupo years old. That's 28 in human years. He's at that age when he should be looking for a mate. But before Mog can become an adult, he first needs to learn how to fly. And not trip up on stuff. Even though Mog trains hard every day, he still can't seem to get off the ground. Dude, he just jumped! I saw that only a couple seconds ago. To be fair, his wings are kind of small, and he's pretty big. He's not gonna fly. Looks like he's still got a long way to go. Aww. Here's where you can come in. Help Mog learn how to fly by pushing OK and feeding him his favorite Koopo nut. But don't overfeed him. He won't be able to fly if he's too fat. I'll give you a nut. Oh, get the nut! Oh, don't get a fat tummy now. I'll give you another one. Um, I don't really have an option to, like, not feed him. I'll give you one more. How about number four? Like, this is, like, the only option you're given. I can't really press anything else. So I guess I have to keep giving him nuts until he's, like, completely full. Oh, he's good. Okay. I mean, oh? It seems like Mox decided to take another shot at it. Can you do it? Can you do it? Oh my god, he did it! He's flying! Now he's finally become a full-fledged Mog. You pay guild for this kind of game, really? No, happy music. And he just goes home. Tired but relaxed, our little Mog turns out the lights early and goes to bed. Good night and sweet dreams. Oh, what's this? Here comes a female Mog. Oh, this is awkward. It seems like he likes her. What the hell is she even standing on right there? Now, will Mog be able to fly gracefully in front of her? Help him out with a few Koopo nuts. Here you go. You're gonna watch him eat these nuts? I don't wanna feed him like too many at once. Just give it a little bit of time. Okay, you're good. I think we'll just bleed it out a little bit. Otherwise, he might get too full. Put it out a little bit more. Okay, you're good. You've had your nuts. Come on, do it! Do it! Mog was able to do it! Yay! Now you're gonna get some of that Mog action! You're gonna snoodle the Moogle! Do it! She must have fallen for his graceful flying form. Oh, now she's gonna have to gobble some nuts of her own. I mean, uh, sometime later. Looks like things are going well with this who's new Mog friend. Time for a quiet date in the forest. Her name is Mag. She's a good-natured Mog. Huh, Mag and Mog. <laughs> Sitting in a shroom. K-I-S-S-I-N. June, I don't know. 
Best of luck to the both of you, Mog and Mag. May you have lots and lots of healthy Mogs. Oh, they already did. Oh, one of them is golden. And pink. Oh, uh, okay. Haven't you ever heard of, you know, using protection? This is like that episode of The Simpsons where Sam's little helper met this other Greyhound and they had like 25 puppies. Uh, no worries there, I guess. Finn. I hope I got a lot of GP for that, because I basically just increased the Moogle community in a video game. I didn't get anything? Well, that was a waste of time. I'm just gonna leave this area out of spite. I'm trying to figure out where to get out of there. There we go. So I'm guessing that's not where Barrett went. Uh, station? Let's try the station. Oh, there's something going on here. What happened? Shh! Shimmer soldiers, even here. Attention! Dismissed! They went everywhere but where we were too. Lucky us. Let's see what's going on in the chocobo racing. Go! Do it! That's it! Hey, Hatsune Miku. Would you like to buy some Chocobo tickets? And explain. This Chocobo race is a run on a virtual course. The natural scenery you see here in the race doesn't really exist. You pick which Chocobo will finish first and second here. And then buy the appropriate tickets. And if the ticket you purchase is a winner, you'll receive a ticket for an item that will be listed on the panel. You can exchange your tickets for items or GP at the exchange counter to the front of the entrance. Or to the right of the entrance, rather. Authorized personnel only, yes, screw you. Okay, there's the exchange booth right over there. Who has nothing to say, but I guess I can only exchange it over here. Hey, see that chocobo on the odd sheet? That's how you can find out about a chocobo's condition. Hmm, if you find out which are the strongest, then it's easy, right? Well, not as easy as you think. It's not just a matter of the chocobo's strength. But it also depends on the jockey and the chocobo's personality. If these are bad, the chocobo may use too much stamina. We'll come back to that at some other point, but for now... Let's see, let's check out the other areas. Have we been everywhere? Okay, we have been here. Where the hell did Barrett even go? I have no clue whatsoever. I mean, we have probably have enough points to actually save the game in here, but I'm not going to bother with that yet. Okay, whatever. You're going to have lots of fun. Good for you, I suppose. It's like... Where do you actually go? I have a feeling you might have to go here. But there's only just a Wonder Square. And there's no other floor after this. Seems to be out of order. Yeah, it seems like a, some of the machines are just not usable. Wish there was a way to get some clues as to where you need to go next. I feel like we exhausted almost everywhere. Blah, 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 yeah, whatever. Did we go to the round area? I won't take this attraction. You will be able to see all of Gold Saucer Park on this ride, so please just sit back and enjoy a lovely view you won't see anywhere else. Oh, I can only take two? I'll take Eris. Sorry, Kate Sith, but you're kind of new. You need to, like, earn your stripes like everyone else here. Oh, how nice! Oh, 
that actually is a pretty nice view, I will admit. It's weird you can actually use the D-pad to just bob your head. Yeah, no, yeah, no, yeah, yeah. Uh, oh god, I got an itch. No, no. Ares is looking at me like, what the hell are you even doing? You're just gonna give yourself some neck problems or something. It's so pretty. And it is true, they put a lot of work into like designing this place. Even though it looks like some of the areas on the bottom look like they're fragmented. But I guess it adds to its charm. What the hell is that figure supposed to be? It's got the very tiny wings! And a giant chest. Oh, we got more to see. Ugh. That must be the hotel area. Don't think I'd want to be buried there, that's for sure. And again, do they even put real bodies in there? Why does it look like Cloud has a 5 o'clock shadow, like, in this view? Wow! Kate Seth must be very popular. They seem to have a lot of, you know, statues of him. How long is this ride, anyway? Oh, never mind, it's done. Well, at least we just finished. Still haven't got any, like, clues as to what is happening. Guess we can check out the battle square next? Oh! Okay, I see what it is. It was really just, like, a place to go. It's just one of those hubs. Maybe you had to get to the very top. Thank you for coming to the Ghost Hotel. Ugh. For reservations, please step up to the counter. Ugh. Uh, you're ugly, so I'm gonna go over this way. So you gonna sell me shit or what? Welcome! I find it very ironic you have like Phoenix Downs and yet you're a dude that's hung. For sale? Well, that's not really helping me much. Please, please register at the counter. You know, I don't even think I have to be here. Where haven't I been to? Like, Battle Square? Okay, this was where we had... where we need to go next. Hmm? Dead. What? Why? I don't know, I wasn't there when it happened. Cloud, where are you going? The stairs, probably? Oh, jeez, a lot of people died here. Did Sephiroth do this? No, it's not him. They're all shot. Sephiroth would never use a gun. So it must have been Barrett then. Ugh, ugh. Hey, what happened? Oh, a man with a gun on his arm. It can't, it can't be. Hold it right there and stay quiet. Uh, Dio, we didn't do this. Did you guys do this? No, it wasn't us. Him, I must have been wrong. Hurry and run. It's gonna get ugly. Hey! Stop them! Uh, I don't think we 
gonna be here. That's as far as you go! Wait! Listen to! Cloud! This is not what we had in mind. I guess we're not gonna fight? One more to go. Yes. Hey! Pay attention! I don't need to hear it. Pay for your crime below. Do it! Yes. Gateway to heaven, then why are we going down? You alright? Where are we? A desert prison! Corral pris prison! A desert prison? Yep! A natural prison in the middle of the desert. Surrounded entirely by quicksand. I heard that once you get in, you never get out. But... There was special one special exception. Hey, Barrett. Hey, uh, what are you doing in prison, dude? Barrett. Did you stay back? This is something I gotta deal with. Just leave me alone. You! That's one of your friends? He sure looks dangerous. Um, you're the one riding a fat moogle. Cloud, what should we do? Barrett's not his normal self. Uh, I guess the only thing we can do is, like, can we go in this building? Oh, apparently you can fight in here. What the hell are those things? Two-Faced? Oh, I didn't even put any materia on Eris. I really should do that. I can use a Manipulate. Let's try that. And if you manipulate them... Oh, you, you can't do it on those enemies, apparently. Wait, what was that? I pressed left. I was trying to aim at one of the other Two-Faces. But then I accidentally targeted Cloud. Which Kate Sith actually covered. That's hilarious. He looks like he's just having a good time. Right, let's get some material on Eris first. Okay, Tifa is the other one with material, so let's take those off. And Yuffie can take hers off as well, because she's not with us. I should get this all arranged first. We'll give you transform. And uh, no, actually, we'll give you restore. This one. Restore all. And let's say ice all. Give you an enemy skill. Steel, I suppose. And ifrit. Okay, first thing we need to do, we gotta find ourselves a save station. I don't know if you're gonna find one down here, but we're gonna try. Oh, here's a new enemy, and that's one we don't want to be dealing with for so long. I think it's called a bandit. Those guys will try to steal from you, and they can run away faster than the other guys could. You know, like the predecessors. So let's just get them all killed immediately. Uh, who leveled up? Was it Eris? Nice. Oh, okay. I don't feel safe down here. And they grab whatever was down there anyway. I guess you can get out this way. I probably won't be able to go far. Oh, we can't go to the desert yet. So I guess we have to go down. Fair enough. There better be a save station right next to it. Nope, just more of these jabronis. Alright, fine. You got fire too, that's nice. Oh, that's right, because I got the fire material on him. That would make a lot of sense. So, 
let's just nuke those jabroni ponies right now. Oh, God. They stole the bolt plume! Okay, these... That guy's gotta... Gotta go. And he's stole an elixir! That bolt plume is super rare. And elixirs are... Not easy to get. So... It was a good thing we got those back. Cause that would've really sucked if we lost those items. This one's been shot too. Oh, there is a save sta- Never mind. Well, there was a save station, but we're not gonna go to it right away. Okay, more of those two faces. Alright, well... I guess we can take those guys out, and then we'll be done with it. Are you sure those guys cannot be manipulated at all? Yeah, I guess it ain't gonna always work. How did you- Oh, you stole the Phoenix down! Nice! That is quite good. Okay, your weapon has a microphone, but you decided to, like, uh, use the giant guy's fists. Makes sense. Eh, whatever works. Ha ha ha! I'll tell you one thing, rookie. This desert is extremely dangerous. It'll welcome you in, but when you try to leave, it'll swallow ya. I hear some of them never make it out. The best thing is to stay out of the desert entirely. Why does this guy have to be so close? It creeps me out. But on the plus side, at least we're finally able to save. So, we'll stop the video right here, and in the next part, we'll continue exploring this area. Goodbye, everyone. Thanks for watching.